Hey guys, Ken here with Tax Canine. Uh, first off, um, if you're watching this video, you're probably working with me in some way, shape, or form, whether it's through our Walk Doctor program or through our individual private training lessons. Um, I want to shoot out a really quick thank you uh, video, and I really mean that. Thank you very much for the opportunity. Uh, I really look forward to working together and helping you create the dog of your dreams. Um, that's what my intention is. Um, a couple things that we're really going to be focusing on, and yes, we're going to be working on on what the program entails, whether it's the walk program or whether loose leash walking or it is um, the Fabulous Five program um, through our individual private training lessons. But the main thing I want to get across to you is something I wrote up here. It says, a good dog starts with leadership and you are the pack leader. So you have to lead, and, and this is a, gonna be a common theme, and I want you to understand that I'm always gonna to go back to this theme because a dog follows the leader, a pack leader. Um, and we're really gonna cover that in three areas. One, it's through building a relationship. Now to build a relationship, we have to establish communication. Um, we have to be able to communicate with that dog, and we're gonna do that through the leash. And all of that's gonna happen through the leash, but you're learning a new language here. And, um, but it's a language that when you practice through repetition is gonna, you're gonna become very fluent in. Um, so yes, we're gonna, we're gonna be talking about teaching the tools and teaching how to communicate with the leash, but the next step comes the reinforcement phase where you're gonna practice that and you're gonna live it daily. And it doesn't take much, it just takes you uh, taking the time to apply it. There's not a lot of effort that's, a, that's really required here. Um, and then, you know, in that sort of uh, building relationship stage, and once we have accomplished those other two steps, we're going to start to test it out, proof it, and make it a consistent, reliable behavior. Um, but then we move on to other areas we're going to cover about structure. And I, I can't stress this enough. The structure is what helps the dog focus on communicating with you. When he doesn't have to worry about the outside world influencing them, he can focus all of the attention on one thing, you, the pack leader. So we're gonna talk about crate structure, we're gonna talk about nutrition, we're gonna talk about feeding, we're gonna talk about all those great, wonderful things. Um, and then last but not least, we're gonna go into just how can you apply the dog's uh, new, new trained skills and your new trained skills into your day-to-day -day life. And in the end, that's really what we're gonna get. Yes, we're gonna work on commands and we're gonna work on certain, you know, behaviors like sit, down, stay, all that great, wonderful stuff. And all that's done through the relationship building process. But in the end, it's the application of what we've learned on a consistent basis. Uh, and you demonstrating that and making sure that you adhere to that through leadership that you are gonna find that uh, you're gonna have a great, wonderful dog. And that's truly my goal. So guys, I really wanna say thank you very much for the opportunity. I really look forward to working with you and understand that my goal in the end is for you to have the best dog you've ever had. Then these skill sets that you're gonna learn now will apply to every dog thereafter. And skill sets that I've taught you now, if you have family, friends, neighbors that are being challenged by the dogs, the same things that you're challenged with, I strongly encourage you to share that information with them and try and help them. You, you've made the investment, you've made the financial investment work working, working with me, and now I'm gonna ask you to make the time investment so that we can really get the return on the investment that you've made. But once you have it, these skills are lifelong skills that you can help work with your next dog that you come that comes into your life or, or, or other people's dogs that are struggling. Um, and if you can help them, great. And if you can't, well, of course, uh, you know, if you're happy with me, then send them my way. But um, before we even get there, I got to work with you. And I'm really excited about it. And uh, I just kind of made this video so that you get to know me um, a little bit better. If you haven't met me through the, through, through, through the program, we've maybe only chatted online. You could put a face to a voice and all that good stuff. But hey, my goal is to help you create a happy, healthy relationship between you and your dog. That's truly my goal. So I thank you very much. And remember guys, a good dog starts with you being an effective pack leader. Thank you for choosing me, Ken, with Tags Canine, and I look forward to working with you. Thanks.